everybody, welcome to the video. So, this video is going to be a little bit different. But Joe, there's something that's already different. What happened to your face? I shaved off the beard. Um, I am going to Croatia uh, next week and I don't really want to go on holiday with a big bushy beard. So I got rid of it. Um, it's a good choice to do. I was only growing the beard because I'm lazy and I just let the beard grow. So yeah, here's me without the beard. I have stubble, but I will shave and clean shave before I go on holiday. But that, that doesn't matter. What matters is five tips to diet down if you have an ileostomy. I've had my ileostomy almost 10 years. I dieted for an entire year last year and I lost about two and a half stone. I learned a lot in that time and then I've applied it to the last eight weeks and in the last eight weeks, I have dieted again, and I lost 20 pounds. So, these tips could really help you out. If you learn something, please like the video. If you like the video, like the video. Share it with people, and without further ado, it's gonna be a little bit different. Let's get into the video. Okay, tip number one is meal timing. Now, someone with an ileostomy, this is very important, because you should eat little and often through the day, anyway for your general digestive health if you have an ileostomy bag so you can have a big meal in the morning big meal at lunch and a big meal in the evening or you can have you know small little meals throughout the day maybe you want to eat once twice three four five six seven eight ten times whatever it is that fits you as long as you're eating every couple of hours now i eat generally three big meals a day and then a snack in between so why is this good for dieting well one, it makes you full throughout the day because, you know, you're not very far away from another meal. And two, it stops that acid buildup you get in your bag when you have huge periods where you're not eating. So that's tip number one. Tip number two is volumize your food. So eat bigger food for your calories. So here we have 17 grams of Skittles and then we have 170 grams of blueberries. Now that's 10 times different. So it's 10 times more blueberries than there are Skittles. But are the Skittles higher in calories? Uh, no, you know, the blueberries, you're getting 10 times more food for the same calories as you can see on screen. So let's get rid of these. It's not just, you know, obviously sweets and fruit are gonna be different. But let's look at just potatoes. Two normal potatoes weigh 390 grams. But you can have one, two, three, four sweet potatoes for the same amount of calories but look it's 90 grams heavier therefore 90 grams more food for the same sort of calories so you're volumizing your food you're eating more tip number three is going to be salads now they tell you to avoid salads when you first get an ileostomy because you're not allowed lettuce nuts seeds uh, dried fruit skins celery you know it tells you to avoid it. Well, I don't think you should. Um, also, you're more inclined to have fatty dressings, you know, like putting some mayonnaise on your salad to make it taste good. And you just want to avoid those. But you do need to experiment with fruit and vegetables and find out what suits you. I find that I don't have any problems eating lettuce, tomatoes, peppers. I always put some sort of meat with my salad. I always like to sometimes try and put root vegetables with my salad, like squash or sweet potato, and uh, also to help digestion, uh, some fruit as well. Just some uh, like slow digesting complicated carbohydrates to go with your salad. Don't avoid salads, don't let them tell you what you can and can't do, keep trying to eat them. Tip number four is fibre. You should aim for about 30 grams of fiber a day. I'm gonna put the grams of fiber on the food that's on the screen. Now, fiber keeps you fuller throughout the day. It helps thicken up your stool, therefore you'll have less leaks in your bag. Um, also, it's quite high in volume, like I said earlier on one of my other tips, more food equals fuller. Now, if you have an ileostomy, I believe that there's no such thing as too much fiber. It is really good for digestion, and it just keeps you fuller. It makes dieting a lot easier okay so the last one is water we need water to survive but they say to have eight glasses of water now how much actually is that glasses come in different shapes and sizes so it's 2.5 liters a day and that's minimum guys you need to be drinking way more than that you know it's four to six pints of 
water a day. If I told you it was beer, you'd easily get that in. Get that water in, stay hydrated and stay healthy and dieting down.